day five of the BNP Paribas Open, and the competition warmed up in the blistering heat of the Californian desert. With four of the top ten players in action, the day was filled with quality and intrigue, with some impending upsets to follow. Yesterday saw defending champion Flavia Panetta making little work of her meeting against the home player Madison Brengel, whilst former champions Maria Sharapova and Anna Ivanovic also secured their spot to progress to round three. With Serena Williams' emotional Indian Wells comeback match already behind her, all eyes once again turn to the American superstar as she stepped on court for the second time in 14 years. Her opponent making her tournament debut was Serena Diaz. Having had a strong start to the season with back-to-back -back qualifying appearances at Shenzhen and Hobart, the Kazakhstani was hopeful of a first-time impressionable visit. After evident signs of nervousness in her previous match, the world number one was sure to put all previous anxieties behind her, looking to return to her world-class form. And the service has resumed. The increased attention was a little concerned for 19-time Grand Slam champion, as she secured a double break, leaving the underdog struggling with the Americans' untouchable power. And she got that. 15 to the in just 28 minutes, Serena took advantage of two set points. It's all an open set for Serena Williams. The second set was a familiar story. Williams racing to a four-love lead courtesy of her trademark power. Second set race and a fifth on the board. The world number one continued her undefeated streak in 2015, dismissing the 21-year-old in just under 60 minutes. Sealed the deal here in this encounter for the first time she defeats Zarina Diaz in straight sets. The triumph marked her 694th victory and will now face Sloane Stevens as she continues her return to the Coachella Valley. It's good to have everything under under my belt, under behind me, and just be able to have a focus today, and which is what I needed going up against a young player. Earlier in the day, 7 seed Agnieszka Radvanska squared up against a resurgent Heather Watson. Reaching the third round marks the Brits' best appearance in Indian Wells, having achieved a new career-high ranking of number 38 earlier in the year. It was the WTA rising star who held her nerve in the fiercely contested opening set. Oh, that is just a fabulous point. Had a bit of everything in it. And the crowd here on Stadium 2 warming to this type of tennis. 18-time Grand Slam champion Martina Navratilova offered little solace to the world number eight, as Watson wrapped up the first set in fitting fashion. Well, what a set of tennis from Heather Watson. Closes it out with an ace. And the seventh seed is in trouble. The Brit has never beaten a top ten opponent before, but some more big hitting early in the second made that look a distinct possibility. Brilliant. Just a wonderful point from Watson. Radvanska wilting in the heat as Watson powered through the set 6-4 to complete the upset and send last year's finalists crashing out. It's the performance and the result of her young career. Heather Watson, for the first time, defeats a player ranked inside the world's top ten. Simply stunning. Watson will now face 12th seed Carla Suarez Navarro in a bid to continue her fifth campaign at the BNP Paribas Open. Another top seed fell at the third round phase. World number nine, Ekaterina Makarova, lost to Timia Budzkinski, 3-6, 7-5, 6-4, the final score. Simona Halep has started 2015 in blistering form, with two titles to her name already in boasting a 15-2 win-loss record. The Romanian's latest opponent was Vavara Lechenko, who lost in straight sets in their previous meeting at last year's Australian Open. And defending finalist Halep was quick to stamp her authority, a blinding down-the-line backhand proving too much for the world number 31. That's amazing. Look at that. From being pushed down the line to hit a winner down the line, that's impressive. But an unexpected role reversal was to ensue, the American responding immediately in the second, mirroring Halep's efforts from the previous. That's just too good from Evchenko. Suddenly the contest was wide open, the rallies were growing in length and Halep was having to get increasingly imaginative with Levchenko serving for the set. And she's rewarded for a great fighting, great playing. The match back on level terms, but Halep's grand strokes continuing to find their mark with unerring accuracy. This is unreal. <laughs> Lep 
Lomachenko had run out of steam, and the decider was as one-sided as it was in the first set. And she does it! What an effort by the Romanian. Very inspiring performance by actually both players. Great fight. They left it all on the court. Such an example of how women's tennis is looking these days. Elsewhere on court, it was a battle of the WTA rising stars as Karolina Pliskova and Garbine Muguruza met for the third time. Having prevailed over the Spaniard in Dubai last month, the 14th seed repeated proceedings with a 7-5, 6-4 victory. Tomorrow's matches sees the return of second seed Maria Sharapova as she takes on the resurgent Victoria Azarenka as she continues her impressive form following her injury last season. And home favourites Madison Keys and Coco van der Vey take on top 10 players Yelena Yankovic and Eugenie Bouchard for what's set to be another memorable day in the Golden State.